it's it's almost too much. Ow. It's awesome. It's awesome. <laughs> <laughs> that diker, if you see it, um, I have a list. I'll show you later. No, sure. Show. Yeah. Different calibers. Yep. You ready? dead ground maybe get to one of those bushes there. That front bull looks nice. This is a very cool animal, this this um, black wildebeest. They were down to possibly 60, 70 in the world. It's and a and they actually sat there. Yeah. And they chased them into a, a park and they let them breed and then they've released them and now we're hunting them again. So one of the biggest problems here there's so much other game and I think something might have spooked those wallabies. So let's just go a little further. If it's not, we can maybe come back and drive it from the side. Squeeze one into the left hand shoulder of his there. Shoot now? Yeah. That's frontal chest and smoked him. <laughs> Have a look at this cool animal, man. A perfect shot there. He's got these awesome, awesome um, bosses in that. White eyelashes of the wildebeest. You have a look at those two bumps on the back of the. Come a bit forward. Look at those muscles there. They muscles. Those things. They stick out. Got the forward swooping horns. Nice and rock old. He's a a great bull. Hair on the nose. First animal in Africa. Yeah. Put it there, man. Well done. Thank you, sir. Congratulations. Guys, well, it's the first afternoon here. Yeah? We've just come out of the range. Two shots at the range. One shot into a wildebeest. We're on the scoreboard already. But I just thought we'd stop and look at all this game. I mean, we've got wildebeest, black wildebeest, Cape buffalo, blue wildebeest running over there. I mean, blessed back in the distance. We came over the rise here, and on the plains here, yeah, all these Cape buffalo are out grazing it. Yeah, we've got one black wildebeest so far, and a lot more to do, but. Let's see what we do, let's enjoy ourselves and let's put some animals in the salt. Bro. Really got a red face from his first animal, look at that. Stayed behind me. Get on the sticks, I'll tell you which one. One broadside in the middle, if you can squeeze one onto your shoulder. Another one shot kill, bless back, man. Here we go, look at this old big ram. Yeah, awesome animal. Um, we, I mean, we've all hunted them for, from when we little kids. It's a very popular animal to hunt. South Africans love hunting them. It's sort of type of whitetail for us. Everyone's got them. Everyone's hunted one. But 
big old males get these glands over here and they get it the, the, their blaze gets a bit dirty from the from the um the the the, the uh, what do you call this thing the scent gland that comes out there and then it sticks to there and they blow in the dust and gets a bit dirty nice white horns big ridges good shot nice early start to the afternoon we can go hunt some other things after a tough old morning well done man congratulations <laughs> beyond the shoulders, just above the grass level. Put him down. Okay. One blessed buck deserves a harder beast. There we go, my man. Two for two this afternoon. Yeah, that's very nice. Yo. Django's here first, obviously. But I mean, come sit here and we'll just have a look at him. Look at that, beautiful red hartebeest, got these swooping back horns, um, rock hard and old, nice dark shoulder and face, a really, really big bodied one, this one, oh, we might even have to use the winch to get him on, but yeah, he's fantastic, man, they are second fastest animal, nice big thick neck, hey, knocking them down now, put it there, well done. Second fastest animal. Second know. fastest in Africa, yeah. The Chesapeake yeah. is the only one quicker than it, but. Nice. Yeah, this is one you can be very happy with. We'll shoulder mount this one for sure, eh? Yeah, definitely. Yeah, great old bull. He was lying here with the herd, and fortunately, he took a while to get up, and we could just follow him a bit. And yeah, we've had a great afternoon. Put it there. Congrats again. Just this side of it. You can just see his head knocking about there. If you on him, you can squeeze one into the left hand shoulder of his there. It's a hit. Good hit. There we go. About five yards from where from where you shot him. Look at that guy. 
So he's, he's very, very cool. So, yeah, that's what we, what, we, what we want when we have these things. You see how thick and heavy his bases are? He's got nice deep turns, got what we call ivory tips. Very, very, very nice. Nice old, old bull. Rock hard here at the bottom. See, he's getting a post there, but yeah. Um, thick, compact, nice deep turns. Very nice bull, man. Five for five. That's great going. That was a good shot too. Sniper school 101. Walking away from you, the top one. You see him? Got his butt to he's eating in a tree there. Okay, he's going to walk left, keep follow him coming left. There's the top one. You see him? He's, he's down. Yeah, we were in parlor. We saw him first and got distracted by Gems back, but then came back to him. A very nice old ram, nice and hard, nice thick neck. Um, yeah, they always got such smooth skins, these animals. Uh, there's sort of beauty in their plainness, you know. They, their skin's always perfect and they got these beautiful ridges. And that's a very nice impala. Look at that, what we want the big box shape, nice squaring up horns like that. Yeah, very cool, eh? He looked like somebody tagged him there between the hock there. You've got a little hole over there. Yeah, it might just be a sick fit. Anyway, yeah, it's, it's getting late and the beers are not getting any colder. Let's go. You said, shoot him, if you've got a nice shot, shoot him right in the chest, under his nose. One good squeeze under his nose. Yeah, look at this animal, they're pretty, they've got these, these um, like clown faces with the tear ducts that go down. It's one of our few hollow fibered haired animals like, like your guys. Um, yeah, um, but yeah, a very, very nice bull, nice smooth horns, decent bases, yeah, the, just a, a good gemspuck, man, and we looked hard for these, there's not a lot of them around, so we've done well. Back to your usual self with a one-shot kill, well done, man. That's awesome, well done. Very pretty animal.
It was a hell of a shot on a very small animal in the wind at a long distance. Look how pretty these animals are, man. The good old ram, he's got that like, brown color to his horns there. Um, last smooth coat, a bit of repeating over there, but what a shot. He's going to make a great little mound for you and the start of your collecting of the tiny tent. Very well done. There's a, there's maybe one of the best shots. I mean, considering what we're shooting at here, but they, you know, they're very pretty little animals. The are in these wide open plains, so that's their protection. We got lucky we were able to get a, what, 200 odd from him. And one shot, hey. Keeping the, the, the skill going there. Good day again. Thanks for quite good eating these little guys. For one. Ew. Okay guys, we've been here since sunrise this morning, on the last morning of your hunt. We've seen how unlucky you can be. We saw spotted a kuri out about all this morning and we got your buddies here and it just got up and ran. So it shows you how unlucky you can be in hunting, but if you think about how lucky we've been, I mean, Jimmy, you've had sort of everything fall in place. We've Everything we've tried for, we got. It doesn't always happen that way, but some good shooting and a bit of luck, we did well and I think it's been a great hunt. I mean, we've got eight quality animals on your first hunt, that's the about as good as you can hope for, man. Yeah. You guys enjoyed it? Time of my life. Fantastic. Yeah, first time, definitely not the last time. Yeah. And our uh, lucky charm with us every step of the way. <laughs> Thanks for all that, man, it's been great. Yeah. Nice to hunt with you. Long. Nice to hunt with you guys and we'll see what the day brings, but yeah. Hopefully we'll see you again, I'm sure we will. Yes, sir. Without a doubt. Cool, man. <laughs>